I tell you. Mm. Okay. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. Okay. We're there now. We're here now. A big shout yeah. out to all our sponsors, uh, Bush and Wine Adventures. A big shout out to all our sponsors, Olympus Track Foundation. Yeah, it's another one of them candid conversation. After a little bit of that, a little bit of this, yeah, I've been, uh, we, 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 we privileged, we honored to be sitting down with our brother here, Mr. Noah Kerr. Welcome to the show, Mr. Kerr. How you been? Hey, been good, man. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yes. Yeah, I'm um, good. I'm good. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's, it's it, good. Uh, 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 within these moments, within these times, yeah, it's really, really. Yes. Uh, it's a pleasure. It's an honor to sit down and just mm -hmm. talk to people like you on whatever subjects on whatever's going on. But obviously, before we start, mm. yeah, on a real one. Yes. How you How you been keeping? How you been holding up? Kati kati. Uh, you know, kati kati ai. Ijanga, Corona, I know, yeah. Like, uh, how, Corona. how was it? How was it been for you? How ili, ili kwaje kupande wako? I think on my side, uh, uh, generally, is uh, because there's not much happening, so you can't like, you can't go places, you can't go. Mm -hmm. uh, you, you, you literally cannot do a lot of stuff, and if you if you if you add the kids in there, ah, it's, uh, it's literally school home. There you go, school home, school home. Yeah. Uh, if you if you get a few things, you can you, go, you can go to a few like uh, activities outside or things. Mm. But generally, it's kind of like kind of like standstill. Yeah. Although online, you you can do stuff. You can meet people. So mm. personally, I've got. Most of my meetings now are in Zoom. So yeah, yeah. <laughs> Everybody seems to be calling me on Zoom, so that's where I'm meeting. Yeah, uh, stuff. The yes. new, the new normal, still. <laughs> the new normal. Yeah, and it looks, and, and looks like it's here. So he's going to be here to stay. I don't think for a while. In a car, it's going mm -hmm. to be here for a while. So he's going to be here for. A while. Yeah, and it's a situation where. Yes. The rules are being changed left, right, and center. They're shifting the goalpost. Tear this, tear that. You don't know yes. what's going on, to be honest. No, I don't think there's anybody who, like, at a Columbia, yeah, I know what's going on. This and this. <laughs> Nobody does. I think the way the situation is, it's difficult because even them, mm. they are not sure what to tell people because they are, uh, as much as they want to give information, they have no idea what information will work. So maybe they are yeah, gonna top on top of yes, okay. They yeah. call it like guessing. This 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 idea will work, this will not work. Mm. No well like you know, them being a government, they all, well you expect them to come up with a solution. <laughs> yeah, Kabisa. And then yeah. uh twenty twenty the year we didn't even I have, know we didn't even have a summer vision twenty twenty, it's in the year. Oh so, what summer did we have this time? Yeah, <laughs> but I got this yeah. summer here for you. Yes. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. That's the summer. That's my brother's summer. Yeah. <laughs> summer. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Summertime Yatsuba. <laughs> when was it? I think do I even remember when I did this one? I was uh, I was I was literally trying something in Lua. I, I had at this time, mm. you know, I've done music for a while, and and I have not done anything in Lua. Mm. So I was like, uh, well, maybe I should try something. Mm. So this was my first. <laughs> this was my first attempt at doing the uh, Lua track. Right. And it's, yeah, that it was... took me some time. Right. Yes, I think it was uh, yeah. Now let's check in my uh, in my account. A while back, it was a while back. I don't know. It, yes. Okay. I did. I did that. Yes. Speaking I of did that. that spot, yeah. Speaking of that. Yes. Okay. Um, can you just um, give us a background, right? Like where you grew up, your 
early influences and how you ended up, uh, you know, being a musician and all that. Can you just give us a background of how we ended up here, please? Hey, I started, uh, uh, basically, most, most of my artistic background is from school. So mm -hmm. I started quite early uh, because most of the schools we went to, we tended to, the schools tended to excel more in music. Okay. And uh, so we, we, we went to big competition. Mm. So that local national nationals and all that stuff. So mm. that was the grounding for me. And then obviously being in church and stuff. Mm. So my most of my uh, when, uh, my music is coming from those that background. So from school to church. And then after when I came from school mm. uh we we met up with, with some guys and then that was in a in a room. Okay. And then that we, 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 we formed the ISKEN. All right. How early was and this? Basically. How early was this when you that was forming this guy? Uh, in this game. Mm -hmm. I think it was that was ninety what? That was ninety what? I don't even remember what ninety was that was. More than twenty years ago. Is, Ninety eight was it? Oh it's it's more 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 than thirty years ago. More than that thirty episode. years ago. Wow. Yeah, yeah. Okay. This is more than years ago. All right. Wow, so that's, that's, that's amazing. So that's that's really amazing. Yeah. So, mm -hmm. um, what what were the influences like? What what kind of like your early musical influences? Mm -hmm. Whatever made you like gravitate towards music as a whole? What are the early songs you're listening to to make you wanna come out and do whatever you were doing? I think m most my um, my influences uh, mostly for tabula. Uh -huh. uh, this the uh, free side. Uh, Table uh, Rochero, mm -hmm. uh, Franco, Luambo Luanzo uh, Macchiati, Luanzo Macchiati. Mm -hmm. and of mm -hmm. course, uh, guys like uh, Zyko, ah. Langa Langa. Mm -hmm. Those days they weren't that famous, mm -hmm. yeah. but yes, those are my kind of uh, influences. Yeah, it's a kind of music arrangement, okay. Um, yeah, so, especially yes. those early, like, which is it's always been like my favorite topic of conversation sometimes. It's like mm. other people's conception of Afrobeat or African music, right? <laughs> so, yeah, that time when you're talking about the legends like the Franco, Luambo, Luanzo, Macchiadi, like you're talking the Tabulets, yes, um, the Remy Ongalas, Rambayas. Remy Ongala is the, the, the Samwangwana, the Barakamshe. Yeah. You know, in Billy Mani Park. Yeah, yes. Yeah, BBC Billy <laughs> Mani Park. Orchestra Virunga, yes. the Samba Mapangala. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Virunga. <laughs> yeah. But yes. yeah, so that, that yeah. was around the time you're, you're saying. Those were kind of mm -hmm, going mm -hmm. around. Those were, the, those were our influences. Okay. Yes. Okay. That's a beautiful thing. At those times. And you know, those times, yeah, they, they had like live, live music. Mm -hmm. So. Mm -hmm. Uh, you, you would rarely see them on TV, so oh, you had to. You see, yes, yeah. So if if you went to their concert, they would literally be, oh yeah, yeah I want to do that. Mm. Like this one here. Yes. Yes. <laughs> mm. Mm. Yes. I had fun doing this one. Mm. So this is Roomba, right? Yes. Okay. <laughs> right. Um, you were talking to me about uh this can, like thirty years ago. Yes. Back in Nairobi, right? Mm -hmm. 
back in Nairobi. Okay. So what was unique about this can? What kind of music uh, were you doing and um, how did you get together? I think the 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 challenge with the discan mm. came about actually from forming the uh, discan came about because uh, there weren't any disabled people in entertainment. All right. And uh, yes, and for a group of us, we used to go clubbing and stuff. So, mm -hmm. and we used uh, we used to know lots of musicians. Right. And uh, every time we went to pop, uh, guys were performing, we, they would kind of like, oh yeah, can I join it? Yes, yes, yes. Let's do, uh, do something. <laughs> yes. Yeah, yeah. So, because of doing that, so uh, it's like, yeah, yeah, you got, what, what guys, you know, maybe we should start our own group mm. and mm. Uh, see, because we, we hardly see any disabled people coming out. And stuff. Okay. So that's that, that's where the idea came from. All right. So we started we started one uh, actually at the start we, could, we had like about about eight people something like that. Mm. But it was we had a mix we uh, we had, we had a mix kind of like a mixed group mm. because uh, ideally why we had a mix because they, uh, at that time mm. the you know the the music equipment they were very heavy. Oh, okay. So, so if, 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 yeah, if, yeah. <laughs> if, if, if you're gonna, yeah, yeah, heavy lifting, and uh, yeah. Also when, also when we started, mm. we started off wanting to, uh, wanting to to do something at a very high level. Okay. So we started off uh, when we started, we started getting uh, equipment, mm. same from the, uh, from the. Uh, uh, from the, from the these guys, yeah, uh, who are they called? From the commandos, uh, you know the the Maroon, Maroon yes. commandos. Maroon, yes, yes, mm -hmm. from, their, from their from their base, from, yeah, 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 yeah. So from yeah. from their uh, yeah, and uh, and from we used to also get equipment from AP the mm -hmm. AP band. Okay, okay. And uh, occasionally there was a guy, there was a local guy that we used to hire from. Mm -hmm. So yes, so. Basically, they had very good equipment, but they, they had. You had, you had to have some. needed some heavy lifting. Yeah, heavy <laughs> you needed some heavy lifting. Yeah, that was heavy lifting. Right. So logistically, it was. You had to have somebody. We had to do it as a, as a, We had to have like some yeah. good allies. To, so to, at this time, were you were you getting gigs around Nairobi and playing and uh, having shows and all that? Yes. Okay. We did. We did quite. Um, we did lots of action. We did, we did lo lots of gigs in Nairobi. All right. Because and we did. We did lots of. What, which which is one yeah. of your most memorable gigs in Nairobi with this guy, if you can remember any. With, uh, I did, oh, the, oh, which was most. Uh, hmm. Which ones have I done? I, mm. um, or is it such a most long of the time ago? I catch ones. Well, I, I can still remember lo lots of them. Mm. So, of of the ones we did, mm. uh, we had uh, one in the Nyao Stadium, which was organized by th those days. Was this guy called uh, DS? Oh, DS. I'm, I'm not sure what he what. I'm not sure what he calls himself nowadays. He was <laughs> a, a big time promoter. It was yes, and that one had uh, all, all different groups uh, that came to perform, mm. and we were one of the groups that performed. We we had uh, we, we did a few uh, a number stadium. of curtain raisings. You did yeah uh, yeah the national stadium that yeah. time yeah. yeah. We did a, we did a few with the national events like when uh, Moi Day was it Moi Day was it? Yeah. When yeah. Moi was doing stuff, so oh, at right. this uh, at the stadium. We, uh, Yep, so the national we did a few, yeah. yes, cutting raising for the uh, cutting raising for visiting bands, the San Fan Thomas, ah. uh, what's that, Pepe Kale. Ah. Uh, <laughs> yeah, so we did, <laughs> yeah. yeah, so we, we did, uh, we did have a good, uh, a good exposure, run. Uh, a good run, you, we, yeah, yeah, it, it was fun, that's beautiful, and that's we performed beautiful. quite a bit in uh, mm. what's this place now. 
uh, African Heritage. Ah. Also, we, we did have a, a gig at a, a African Heritage. Mm. Uh, that that kind of used to be our, our, our weekend base. We go visit there. Okay. Have a laugh. All the, right. With the, with the, so bookings yes. were coming in. Bookings were the coming booking, in. Booking. You are yeah. cutting so, raising yeah. for every big artist that was coming for a show in Big Nairobi, uh, yeah. you are the opening act yes. for them. We, we, we opened, That's yeah. brilliant. And that time, a lot, everybody used to come, like Pepe Kale, San Fantomas. Yes. The live music, live yeah. African music was a thing to go. Um, love, uh, back then, I think even, yeah. even CDs weren't in the picture back then. It was just tapes, isn't it? Tapes and... No. The, <laughs> can you imagine that? There were just yeah. tapes. Tapes of the big vinyl. CD was... Yeah, I remember them. <laughs> yeah, I remember them. You remember if you, you remember if you're a DJ, you had to carry a oh. suitcase. Uh, yeah, those a few were, suitcases yeah. too. Yeah, because my big brothers <laughs> to make were an DJ. Event. Yeah, that's how I go into the business. Ooh. Actually, my big brothers were all DJs, and that was a little yes. kid. So he'd be like, "Yo, <laughs> they let me carry the suitcases to the nearest wherever where they're DJ." And then when he gets that, he yes. okay, now you can go home, man. <laughs> <laughs> and then the, yeah, yeah, go spin home. your stuff. Yeah, and speakers like go home. I was kind of their roadie and all that. Yeah, that was a good old days. Uh, so talk to me about this. How what was the writing process? Roomba was kind of like your speciality, right? And for for anybody that so, doesn't it, know what Roomba is, can you break it down to them in your own understanding, please, sir? Um. Okay. In, in in Kenya, for example, we had like uh, the, the 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 two local genres that were known most mm. were either Congo mm -hmm. or Benga. Mm. So Benga for us was the the local groups. The mm. our guys like uh, uh, the mushrooms. Who, who was our guys? The, no, mushrooms didn't do Benga. Okay. They, they do, they, yeah, they, 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 kind of different. Okay. Uh, so Virunga. you know, uh, Virunga, yes. Virunga did Benga. So, mm -hmm. uh, so they are Benga. Virunga did uh, Rumba and Sukus. Sukus. Okay. Benga, you know, Benga is like, uh, you know, like uh, when you are referring to Okinawa. Oh, you know, Miss Yanni. All right. Okay. You know, those guys, mm. uh, those, uh, they have a, uh, most of that was done by the, our local languages. Okay. Right? So in like, local oh, vernacular, you, basically, yeah. Vernaculars. Right. So those, most, most of that was Benga. All right. Now, Sukus, uh, Rumba was like, uh, was kind of like the outside a bit because of the movement as a, a, a style of drumming. All right. Okay. So basically, it's, you know, it's, it's, a, a, bit a, little it's, bit. A, it's an, a, no, 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 not all rumba is fast. Some of, some of it uh, is quite fairly slow. So it's like mm. slow dancing. Mm. Uh, some of them have a pace, but most of rumba is kind of like, uh, you know, kind of like buying or, borrowing it from say like cuba so it's okay. come okay it's come it, yes so it's, right. it's come i think we are, we are getting it from from our side we're getting it from the congo oh, from, from the, the, the groups right. that i used to yeah from the Congolese. so that's where we're getting from so that rumba and uh and Asukus, most of that we're getting from from congo so and a mix a, a mixture of stuff but majority of it Mm. We got it from from Congo. So when we when we started out listening to our music, mm. our big that is where our, our big influences were from Congo. Okay, so so, it, so you gravitated what, towards yeah. that, and that's what everybody was kind of. So they 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 tended to be the what uh, the new thing in it, the, the new boy in a in, in a block. Okay. So, <laughs> the, All right. The, the, the new thing, in, yeah. That was what everybody so, was kind of doing. Yeah. All right. Yes. So, yeah. Um, 